Hey, what's poppin' YouTube world? It's your boy Sneaker Creep, 88, coming to you with another pickup. New pickup slash old pickup. Um, I know I ain't blogged in a minute. It's been like a month since I blogged. But um, I've been busy because the wife is expecting now. So um, I've been trying to get everything in order with that. So uh, that's why I haven't blogged in a while. But like I said, I, I do got two pickups. I got a pickup that I picked up today. And then I got an old pickup, which I picked up um, about a month ago. But I just had, hadn't had the time to vlog about it. So we just going hot right into it. Um, of course, the first pickup being the pickup I grabbed today. Um, as you can see, it's the Air Jordan 2. The Chicago Bulls colorway. Um, not really much to say about them. Of course, today being Monday 17, 2010. These don't drop until May 22nd, 2010. So these are not coming out until Saturday. But I got them today. And here they are. Uh, let me just chirp just a little bit. This is the Air Jordan 2. Chicago Bulls colorway. To me, by far, this is the best Air 2 colorway. So you know this was a must grab for me. And believe it or not, these are actually sold. These sold out like almost everywhere in Philly already. Everybody that's selling them early already sold out. And um, if you don't have a pair of these, you better even try to get a pair. So we're going to hop right into it. Uh, first and foremost, uh, we're going to start with the bottom. Um, the bottom, of course, is the classic two bottom um, that has Jordan written right here at the bottom. This is before he actually started using the, J the Jumpman logo. Um, you have the white, red, and black rubber sole. Um, uh, also, you have the uh, the black around the hill. The black around the hill, and you also have the white tip around the toe um, of the rubber sole. You have white uh, tumble leather all the way around. Um, of course, you have your white and your red, um, uh, I guess you'll call it a hill tag with your Nike in the back. Um, of course, like I said, these these are the classic twos, so um, not really much change. Of course, you, you have your black laces, um, you have your uh, Jordan, your Air Jordan right there uh, with the wings instead of the actual Jordan logo on the front. You have your 23 tag right there at the toe, then you have your red Jumpman right there at the bottom um you, i'm sorry black jump man not a red one that's basically it um of course in my in, in my other blogs you guys seen how um where jordan got the actual uh where he actually got the uh idea to actually create these and these were actually made from like an italian boot uh and of course you, you got to, i forgot to mention you have the, the little lizard skin the little lizard imitation skin right here around the side. But, you know, this, this is actually a pretty good shoe. I actually think these were made better than the Countdown Pack 2s. Uh, the quality of these, to me, are just a little bit better as far as, like, the stitching and the glue. There's not a lot of stitching or glue around them. So, um, yeah, those are these. Uh, let me show you the other one of the 2s. Uh, once again, I can't get um, I can't get retro cards because I still wear grade school. They only do them in men's, so... Uh, here are the Air Jordan 2s, the Chicago Bulls colorway, um, a classic two and a half. Um, I don't think it, it get no better with the, with the uh, Countdown Pack colorway and the Air Jordan 2 colorway. That's basically it. I mean, the, uh, the Chicago Bulls colorway. It's basically it with the 2s. I, I, I don't really feel the all black ones, the stuff ones, or whatever you call them. I don't really like them. I already got the 2s. So, that's it. And my, la and my last pickup, um, my latest pickup were uh if you can't see them just yet i, I gotta go in the case to get them they were in the case um my last, i mean my, my pickup that i picked up like last month were the air jordan 11s the 25th anniversary 11s um yeah we definitely about to hop into these i didn't have a chance to show you these uh, like i said because i was a little bit too busy but I, oh yeah you know your boy greg so we're gonna hop right into it um, of course, we're going to start with the bottom. We have an icy bottom, uh, the icy rubber bottom all the way around with, with the white rubber on the toe box and on the heel box. Um, of course, you, you have the, 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 the uh, significant, significant three dots that always come on the 11s with the uh, Jordan low, uh, Jumpman right here on the carbon fiber that, that's underneath the rubber. Um, around it, you have, of course, the white rubber all around it as well as the, uh, a little bit of the icy bottom coming up at the tip. Uh, the entire sneaker, for the most part, around the sneaker is uh, white patent leather. Pretty good. Um, of course, everybody know about patent leather and on the 11s. Um, they really don't give any. Of course, you have your white mesh hair. Um, and then you have a, a nice... You have a nice soft leather. I don't, I don't really think this is tumble leather where the actual jump man is supposed to be, but 
uh, this leather is actually really, really soft. It's very, very treated, very, very nice. I actually like this leather. You have the Silver 2-3 um, right here on the back. You have the Jor Jumpman Jordan right here on the tongue. That's in silver. Of course, you have your, your white laces. And then you have your little silver Jumpman right in there. Um, of course, you have the inside where it says quality basketball product inspired by the greatest player ever. That's in white and silver. And that's basically it for these. I'll show you these again. Um, for everybody that slept on these, y'all slept on something nice. I know a lot of people said these were the knockoff Columbia's, um, but uh, these will definitely be worth something uh, come a few years from now because these were definitely unique. I think it, it brought out the uniqueness to actually take out uh, the actual jump man because to me it makes it better. It's an all white plain sneaker, so to take away the jump sign, jump man sign, it actually makes these sneakers a lot more subtle. Instead of being as loud, because these sneakers are really not loud anyway. These are very so sneakers. So, um, that's basically it. That's all that I've grabbed uh, since the last time i seen you. Except for, like, um, little kicks here and there, like shells and all that. But, yeah, these are my pickups. Um, I, now I'm going to show you what they look like on feet. Okay, so here's what the Air Jordan 2 Chicago Bulls colorways look like on feet. Um, of course, I'm just playing these with a pair of basketball shorts. Um, I didn't really put anything on with them, so, um, yeah. But, um, otherwise, other than that, it's a very comfortable shoe. Um, it feels basically just like the, if you have the Countdown Pack 2s or you have the original or retro 2s, you know that, um, these are not the most comfortable sneakers, um, that Jordan has ever made, but these are really, really nice. Um, like I said, these are something that you can throw on with a nice pair of black, uh, black skinnies and a white tee or something. I'm um, gonna we'll go ahead and show you all sides of them. Um, these are definitely to me. These are serious basketball sneakers. These have great ankle support uh, for sure. So um, yeah, uh, the next sneakers I'm getting ready to show you are the Air Jordan 11s. Okay, now here are the 25th anniversary Air Jordan 11s. Um, of course, these are very comfortable. Um, I really, really like these. Um, I don't think I would take these over the Space Jam, but, uh, I, I really, really do like these, though. These are something that are unique. I probably won't wear these at all. These probably just sit inside the Jordan cage where they've been sitting for the past month. Um, yeah, these are, these are really cool sneaker. Of course, the patent leather don't, don't really give away none. But, um, I guess if you was to wear them enough, uh, you can actually break these in, but I, I wouldn't recommend wearing these, like I said, because these are all white. These are something that you just want to collect. Uh, you go to see both, both the bottoms of them, icy, never been worn. So lovely. So, yeah, these are the Air Jordan 11s, and I just showed you what the Air Jordan 2 Chicago Bull colorway looked like, and the Air Jordan 11 25th anniversary. Hi, YouTube world. So, I just showed you um, what they look like on feet. Um, again, the Chicago Bulls colorway Air Jordan 2s and 25th anniversary uh, white and silver um, Air Jordan 11s. Um, Y'all know the drill. Uh, rate, comment, and subscribe. Um, don't think I don't appreciate the love just because I haven't been on. I just, like I said, I've been real busy. But I'm about to be getting back into the flow of things. So um, definitely look me up. Um, check me out. Follow me on Twitter. Uh, Twitter.com forward slash sneaker free. Again, that's Twitter.com forward slash sneaker free. Um, again, like I said, y'all know the drill. Rate, comment, and subscribe. And I am over and out. This is Sneaker Freak, and I'm signing out. Peace.